Good morning, church. Welcome to Thursday, April 16th. Our scripture this morning is Psalm 16, a song of trust and security in God. Protect me, O God, for in you I take refuge. I say to the Lord, you are my Lord. I have no good apart from you. As for the holy ones in the land, they are noble, and whom is all my delight. Those who choose another god multiply their sorrows. They drink offerings of blood that I will not pour out or take their names upon my lips. The Lord is my chosen portion and my cup. You hold my lot. The boundary lines have fallen for me in pleasant places. I have a goodly heritage. I bless the Lord who gives me counsel. In the night also my heart instructs me. I keep the Lord always before me because he is at my right hand, and I shall not be moved. Therefore my heart is glad and my soul rejoices. My body also rests secure. For you do not give me up to Sheol or let your faithful one see the pit. You show me the path of life, and in your presence there is fullness of joy. In your right hand are pleasures forevermore. The word of God for the people of God. Thanks be to God. Poet T.S. Eliot once described the incarnation as the hint half guessed and the gift half understood. This description is as truthful and encouraging a description as one can find for the claim that the word became flesh and lived among us from John 1:14 is a truth beyond our mind's reach. It is one that we can glimpse in part, as the poet reminds us, as a hint half-guessed or a gift half-understood. But what a hint and what a gift. The psalm Peter remembers and quotes in his Jerusalem sermon is one that we might take to heart this Easter week. Its message reassures us in difficult times and lifts us when we are weighted down with sorrow or fear. Protect me, O God, for in you I take refuge. How might you take this to heart today? Perhaps by doing something simple, if necessarily, if not necessarily easy, like practicing resurrection amid the sorrow and worry or suffering that you may face which often feels too heavy to bear. Protect me, O God, for in you I take refuge. Practice trusting that God will always stay at your right hand, and you shall not be moved. Try practicing this today as you deal with some of the problems nagging at you or a worry that weighing on your heart. Let go and let God. The best we get at understanding resurrection are hints of this gift in our lives. Opening ourselves to receive some glimpse of this presence will suffice. Like learning piano scales, it's an exercise that we can never fully master. It's given to us to teach us again and again to teach us the fundamentals. But the practice can free us in faith to live into the deeper music that our lives are meant to be. Let us pray. Oh, protect me, O oh God, for in you I take refuge and be with those who are suffering and those who are missing those and lost Be with each one of us this day and this week. In Jesus' name we pray. Amen.
Be thou my vision, O Lord of my heart. Not be all else to me, save that thou art. Thou my best thought by day or by night. Waking or sleeping, thy presence my light. Have a blessed day today. Enjoy the beautiful world that God's given you.